All right, guys, Ivan here. In this video, we're going to talk about female bodybuilding. And I got to be honest with you, I don't follow any female divisions. I don't follow women's physique. I don't follow women's fitness figure, even bodybuilding. But bodybuilding is not at the Mr. Olympia anymore. It was for quite some time. And the dominating champion was Iris Kyle or Kylie. I'm not sure how to pronounce her name properly, but she was definitely something special. She was super muscular and she won 10 Mr. Olympia titles, 10, so more than any bodybuilder, male bodybuilder, 10 is an amazing number, but she's not competing anymore ever since Mr. Olympia shut down on women's bodybuilding, she decided to just stop competing, she didn't want to settle for like women's physique, which is pretty much the same thing as bodybuilding right now. Women's physique competitors are not that much smaller than bodybuilders, really, they are also very very big, add them like 10, 15 pounds and they're gonna be there basically I mean they're very very big also but the main topic of this video the one thing that I really wanted to talk about is this woman right here her name is Margie Marvelous and she's marvelous indeed look at the bellies on those quads and take a look at this back this back is so thick it's crazy this is a woman women have dominant lower body dominant legs but to have back like this this is crazy and her arms as well her arms are humongous look at those biceps Look at the size of those arms, this is crazy. This is really crazy for a woman, I mean, this is just really, really impressive. The thickness of that back and the amount of muscle that she carries, I'm really impressed. And now this is her posing at Omaha Pro Show this, uh, this year, 2019. So take a look at this body, take a look at the conditioning, the amount of muscle on her frame. It's just crazy, I didn't know that women can get this big. And I want to talk about also about Mr. Olympia banning these women from competing at the Mr. Olympia bodybuilding division. They basically stopped the division. For what reason? I really want to know what reason. Oh my god, look at this back. I really want to know what is the reason for that. If you guys know, tell me in the comment section below why they stopped that division. I think it was pretty popular. I don't know if women's physique is much more popular than women's bodybuilding. But this is something I would like to watch, honestly. This is a lot of muscle. This is probably more muscle than I will ever have, <laughs> if I'm gonna be honest. This is really a lot of muscle, and this is bodybuilding. This is, I don't care if this is a woman or a man. This is really impressive physique. Women's bodybuilding as a division does exist, still, but not at the Mr. Olympia. And there was some talk uh, early this year, I believe, for example, Nick Strength and Power made a video about it, where the president of the IFBB or one of the main guys up there was talking about bringing back the women's bodybuilding division back to the Mr. Olympia stage, which would be very exciting. I would definitely watch that division. I wouldn't just skip it the way I skip women's figure or whatever. I don't watch those divisions because that's basically like modeling and this is bodybuilding. This is not nothing less than bodybuilding. These bodybuilders, female bodybuilders are probably bigger than classic physique guys. Bigger than some of them. Maybe not in the arms, but as far as legs, I would say so. A look at the size of those legs on this woman. This is insane. This is really, really impressive. I really like what I see. And I hope Mr. Olympia will bring back again. Look at that back. That back is so thick. I envy her so much. I want to have back like this one day. I hope so. <laughs> Honestly, I don't think it's going to happen because this is really supreme. And the details on those legs. The details on those legs. And look at the stomach. It's so dry. She really has the conditioning, she really can bring really tight and dry conditioning. I like what I see, seriously, and I hope, I really genuinely hope that Mr. Olympia will bring back women's bodybuilding at that stage. And whatever is the reason why they stopped this division, tell me in the comment section below if you know, because I have no idea, honestly. Is it just the low interest? Because I don't think that's the case. I don't know, whatever it is, tell me if you know. And uh, if you don't know, try to find out if you don't mind. Anyways, this is it for this video, guys. Really, really impressive female bodybuilder right here. So thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like the video. And also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more bodybuilding content like this. All the best, guys. Bye-bye.